Hey y'all, it's J Dub. Uh, got a trap right there. Can't see it. This is the field that we had coyote tracks in a couple well, a week ago. And we got another trap out there. Has anything messed with it either, so I forgot to show you how much snow we've gotten out here. It's up my boot, so I don't know. It's about 10, 10 inches down here. If you get on top of the mountain, there's about 14, so we'll go up here, we'll go check these other traps and figure I'll bring y'all along with me. Y'all, it's J Dub. We're back out here on the line. Uh, get this ridge line that comes down, it's just a little finger ridge. Get a ridge that follows up there. Coyotes got tracks on it. Came down this line yesterday and there's a trail right up there. I don't know if y'all can see that little orange tag. And they're not, there's a little orange marker up there hanging off trees. There's actually a coyote track there. Come down here, there's a ton of pine trees. It's a real big thicket down here. So, first good place for a cat, as good as anything. So, come in here. I put this right here, little MB550. Uh, dirt hole set. Come up here, I got my. Just some old uh, rooster feathers I got off a buddy of mine. Bundled them all together. Just something for a little eye appeal. Yeah. Duck forward and drove down through here. Hopefully they'll have like a little trail they'll walk. So come up here, we'll make some more coyote sets. All right, y'all. Back out here. Uh, you see we got some coyote tracks coming across this road that we got coming out of that, out of that little holler. Oh, come in here. It's not a big coat, but it is a coat, so we're gonna just dig a hole in over here, put a dirt hole in it, and uh, see if we can catch him. Uh, I'm actually gonna put a camera, take it back. I'm gonna put a dirt hole up here, on top here. That way I don't have a risk of actually sliding into it with the four wheeler coming up and down here. I'm gonna put my camera on that tree. Hopefully catch a video of y'all of a coat. So I appreciate y'all watching. Put this set in real fast and I'll show it to you as I'm done. You see, I don't know how we see. We got some more coyote tracks going out through the snow on this ridge. As far as I know, no one's ever trapped this ridge because I'm the only one that ever comes up here and does it with a four wheeler. So we're back out here pretty far, so I'm pretty sure these coyotes ain't gonna be wise to anything. I'm gonna come up here, put a dirt hole right here underneath this tree. Hope we'll catch one coming back through here again. From what I understand, they walk by the same track all the time. So I'm gonna set another dirt hole in. I think I'm gonna put this one on a drag, maybe. I don't know yet. It's not really very thick brush around here, so I might beat a stake in. All my other stakes went in pretty good. So I'll, I'll keep y'all posted. All right, so we got our, our last set in here for the day. Uh, we all can see the track. I chose light a little bit. All right. There it is, you can see. There's a dirt hole, pans right here. I put these little blocking trees up just to try to keep from coming in on that side. And his tracks are right over there, going off in the woods. I did beat a drag in there, so hope we'll have him in the next day or so. Calling for another six inches of snow tonight, so I appreciate y'all watching and I'll try to catch another yoke for y'all.